Getting started with Medic Mobile. This is Nurse Mary. Her clinic recently began using Medic Mobile to register pregnancies and coordinate antenatal care. This is Susan, the community health manager at the clinic. Recently, Susan read that Medic Mobile helps clinics improve ANC attendance and facility delivery rates. She learned that Medic Mobile works best in clinics that provide community-based maternal and child health services, want to communicate with and collect data from community contacts, including community health workers, have consistent cellular network connectivity and reliable power, can provide training to community-based users on basic cell phone use and reporting to Medic Mobile. Since her clinic met all of these requirements, Susan thought Medic Mobile would be a helpful tool for her clinic. This is Jonathan, the clinic director. Susan explains Medic Mobile to Jonathan, who gets excited. He asks Susan to create a budget for implementation. Susan uses the budget estimator provided by Medic Mobile to create her budget. A computer is required to run Medic Mobile software, which sends and receives messages from community health workers and visualizes data. Susan's clinic already has a computer, so the cost is zero. Mobile phones for her community health workers to send and receive messages from Medic Mobile. $20 per phone times 20 community health workers equals $400. CHWs can also use their own phones. A GSM modem with an active SIM card that will be plugged into the clinic's computer for sending and receiving SMS messages, $25. Airtime for the clinic's SIM card and for CHWs to send and receive messages, $7 per month total. Two-day training session and printed reference cards for community health workers on how to send simple SMS reports to Medic Mobile, $400. The total cost for Susan's clinic to adopt Medic Mobile is $832. After that, it will just be $7 per month for airtime. Susan presents her budget to Jonathan, who agrees to look for existing funds and talk to some of the clinic's donors about supporting this new initiative. With Jonathan's approval, Susan begins creating a plan for implementation. First, she needs to select a project manager who will oversee implementation and monitoring of Medic Mobile. Susan decides that she will manage the project. Next, she needs to procure the required hardware and install the Medic Mobile software on the clinic's computer. Susan asks her colleague Paul, who manages data at the clinic, to help with these tasks. Paul helps Susan purchase hardware and install Medic Mobile on the clinic's computer. Finally, Susan schedules a training session for clinic staff and community health workers. After attending training, Community health workers leave equipped with mobile phones, airtime, and reference cards. Susan checks each day to make sure that the computer is on to send and receive messages. She relays important information to Nurse Mary about which patients are coming for visits and any upcoming deliveries. Susan also monitors Medic Mobile to ensure that community health workers are sending reports on a regular basis. She hopes that Medic Mobile will help patients feel taken care of and that more women will attend their antenatal care visits and deliver at the clinic. Download our complete installation guide at medicmobile.org/diy.